probably the subject that has the greatest number of learning apps developed, including apps developed by teachers themselves, is mathematics, being a topic that allows the easiest productions to facilitate simple arithmetic calculations. But time has far gone beyond the need for simple calculations, and present applications target to aim at providing virtual manipulatives or digitally tangible tools to offer explorations and thus understand better the basic underlining principles of mathematics. These tools and proper approach in methodology attempt to rescue the subjects from being the most feared topic in school. Virtual manipulatives offer platforms, for example, in exploring the different visual representations of fractions and allows understanding how fractions can be brought under a common denominator with dynamic illustrations of simple explorative interactions of the user. The teacher can demonstrate interactions on the interactive board by physically interacting with the visual objects on the board itself or from the tablet screen. Children can then repeat the interactions on their own tablets, experimenting with the manipulatives until the desired construction is attained or take a peek on the projected board itself, if in need, figuring out the process of the construction. After that, they are faced with their own similar tasks to transfer their learned knowledge into solving alternative problems. Later on, more abstract representations of fractions could also be understood, and assignments can be made more fluently to achieve good scores and quicker results. The creative twist of teachers' minds produce tasks for children that need their fluent use of technology as well as basic mathematic principles to come up with a solution. Like in this activity where the teacher embedded the class assignment mirrored and children had to take photos of it and find an application with which they can turn back the mirroring in proper orientation to be able to read the task itself. Children learn the use of several types of digital tools and try to apply their use in different ways, under emerging conditions or varying surfaces, exploring the ultimate use of the tool for measurement purposes. Children are free to choose the object of exploration and find a way to utilize the tool itself for the purpose. They frequently use the camera of the tablet to document their findings and embed the picture extended with their explanations into their digital copybooks. Alternatively, they take a picture of the object of exploration and use the embedded tools for measurement and then compose the explanation in text or handwriting in order to document the process of their own experiments. In some cases, children are posed with problems that they have to solve using their creativity in finding out ways to approach the problem itself. Like in this example, children try to find out the area of the interactive whiteboard using the combination of physical and virtual tools.